Yo ho ho and a bottle of rum. Welcome back, all ye land lovers, and welcome to another Sea of Thieves ASMR video with me. Today we are in the safer seas mode, which is a brand new setting that was just introduced. I've been very excited about this for a while as someone who prefers single player gameplay over multiplayer. Oh, I think it's gonna storm. Uh oh, stormy seas. That's not good. So I just launched into a safer seas mode and I woke up in this tavern. Let's peek outside the door. It's um, a little dark outside, I think. The sun might be setting too. Oh, it's kind of red, isn't it? Don't they say red sky at night, sailor's delight? So maybe when we go sailing tomorrow, it'll be good. Excuse me, am I putting you to sleep already? That's awfully fast. So here's the plan today, my friends. If you watched my last Sea of Thieves video, it'll be a little similar. We're first going to explore this little island that we're on. And I love this crackling fire. I just love that. And then... We're gonna hit the open ocean on my little sloop. I'm gonna captain you uh, you guys around. And when we get out on the ocean, I will be singing you all some uh, sea shanties. I kind of did one last time, but I kind of whisper sang. And it's pretty hard to whisper sing, but I thought you all might enjoy some softly sung sea shanties. So, if that sounds like your cup of tea, then please sit back, relax, um, keep listening. And I'll mark on the video time stamps, length, whatever, when the singing begins. If you want to skip to that or skip past it. Either way, it doesn't bother me. I can actually sit down, I think, right? Uh... I don't remember what button to press. I turned the HUD off. I picked up a, um, like a thing to do, actually. And it's to obtain some treasure. Like, literally, dig for buried treasure. Which actually sounds really fun. <sighs> oh. And I would quite like to do. Whether or not we make it to dig up any buried treasure, we'll see. It's really dark now, isn't it? It's very, very dark. I don't actually know the name of this place. Last time I, I saw the name of the little island, the little, little spot where you we were in, but this one, I, I don't know. Hello. Oh, your stuff just disappeared. This game has a lot of really good sound effects, like good foley. Gently lapping waves, crackling fires, the soft sand noise we walk on the beach, the creak of the wooden planks on the dock, and the people are all really fun and dressed cool and they look interesting. This place seems to have like a permanent rainy cloud over it. Want to set off at night, so we're gonna have to wait out, wait out there at the night time until the sun rises. So I'll be singing some of my favorite sea shanties and um, also a couple of like really well-known ones. You might know the ones that are my favorites too, but I just mean that the well-known ones are not like my favorites, but everyone knows them and sings them. Um, I really loved listening to the shanties in um, capsized charters in Black Flag. And I have a lot of really fun memories of staying up late at night. Did I hear 
sea shanties last night and I was like, maybe, I'm so sorry <laughs> See, I went to, um, who did I go to to pick up the little quest? I think it was this key guy here This fella And I got like a little a thing from him <laughs> About picking up buried treasure I like how nicely they all react when I walk up to them. They're all very positive. They're like, hello. Ooh, let's see what this person does. Well, she's not massively excited about the fact that we're here, so I guess not everyone likes us. How about you? Oh, look, there's a doggy here. This must be where you buy the pets and sorted pet things maybe it's just maybe not maybe it's just like a general sort of store a general store it's really kind of dark and spooky here i don't like it as much as the other spot where i started in the last video but you can't really choose where you start it's just random isn't it i wonder if i can there we go what's up What's over here? Oh, do you hear that? That's like a real spooky noise. Real looky spooky. That's my ship over there bobbing around. That's it. Oh, look, there's some. Is that like a cave formation? How do we get over there? Let's see. Let me run up here. And if I go this way, up these rocks. There we go. Into the cave. I'm hearing a lot of thunder and there's not a lot of rain. Yeah, this is the back, I think, of where we were earlier. I can't see a thing. It's so dark. Well, this place was considerably smaller than the last starting spot, so I might as well as it believe it's getting a little lighter out, which is very good. Why don't we head over to my ship? Excuse me? Who's making these noises? You? Sir, that's very rude. Sir and or madam. Someone's humming. That's really nice. Lovely to hear. Like a soft hum. Just kind of relaxing. Alright, let's sail away from this infernal place. It's yeah, I don't love it. Uh, I'm gonna turn my U uh, or my HUD back on because it was telling me some stuff. So it says to use the ship's map table to find the island. There's like an island we're supposed to go to, and that's I guess the general direction in which I'll head. Um. Yeah, what was it called? I might have to. Kind of vaguely. The Lagoon of Whispers is definitely where we should head, I feel like. Did it look like that? Okay, I, I think I need to um, take a look. Okay, so we were at Dagger Tooth Outpost, which sounds kind of dangerous. Sounds kind of dangerous. So I had to press this and this and this, and it looks like uh, like that. Okay, it's kind of like a question mark, and the X marks the spot for the treasure. So let me go look at that again. I don't suppose it's actually, it's actually, you know, where it was on the map. That's where we were, um, that's where we started in the last one, which I really liked. Do you see anything that looks like a question mark? I don't, I don't know how close it would be to, come on, a question mark, a question mark. Isle of Last Words, which sounds a little dangerous. 
years. It was in indeed incredibly close. So now I feel just a little bit silly. Alright, now we're gonna sail, everybody. I'm not gonna sing quite yet. Oh, oops, forgot once again how to play this game. Let's lower them to about here and let's raise the anchor. I will be singing about halfway through the video or so. So let's sail to this island first. Let's dig up some buried treasure and then we'll hit the open ocean and we'll just enjoy the day together. Kind of forgot like the direction in which I needed to head to be honest. I think it was like, so I need to go like southeast. I need to head southeast. Turn a little bit more, turn a little bit more. It's a little hard to do this all by yourself. It's nice if you have another pirate to help you. And you're just sort of a, a passive companion on this ship. You can't really give me a heading or raise or lower the anchor for me. I've kind of got to do it all myself. Well, the seas are a little choppy today. So that whole red sky at night, sailor's delight thing, not really working out. Let's verify that we're heading in the right direction. We need to turn more, turn more. Where is it in relation to these rocks? I hope it's nowhere near these rocks. Is it actually where these rocks are? see something sort of in between all the rocks. I'm really glad you guys all enjoyed my last see of these video because I was really looking forward to the Safer Seas update. And I was, you know, planning that if everyone liked the Sea of Thieves content that I could film this. So I'm really happy to be back here in Sea of Thieves. It is quite a fun game that can be made quite relaxing. One of those games that isn't inherently relaxing, but with a few tweaks and the right mindset, it's quite nice. We are sailing against the current. This is not good. I think it's this little spit of land right here. anyone fancy a swim? Let's get a little bit closer. Here it is. Is this the Isle of Last Words? It does. Fantastic. Actually, I'm gonna turn a little bit more. Kind of angle ourselves to leave. It was on the southern part, so I suppose I can keep going a little bit further. And we were really lucky last time, we didn't run into any people or baddies. Well, we saw a few skeletons, but it was minor. Alright, I'd say that's close enough to go for a little swim. And I'm gonna have to remember where on the map the X is marked. Look at those pretty tropical fish. What a lovely, refreshing swim. Definitely could have gotten closer. <laughs> I see something in the water right there. Or, sorry, the water in the sand. I also see a snake. A snake. Snake is a good ASMR word. What's this, then? A firework crate? Should I open it? Use your map to locate the treasure. Alright, I'm a little worried about these snakes, so I'm gonna step up here for now where no snakes can get to me. I've somehow picked up these fireworks, which I don't love. Okay. So, the rocks. We look at it like this. Then it should be in between. Those rocks. So, kind of back where the snake is, though. I really don't want to. Oh my gosh.
gosh, there's so many snakes here. This is a bad island. This is a snake island. That's an ammo crate. Okay, so if this is the one in the water, in the bay, then it's down here. It's about here. Let me get my shovel. I'm gonna try to bury items with it. Well, I'm just gonna try digging. I've only gone and done it, everyone. I have found a buried treasure. I need to dig it out a little bit more. Yeah, keep going. You snakes, stay away from me. <gasps> Let's pick up the castaways chest. I think I've got to take this all the way back to my ship. And you'd think that this would make swimming very difficult, very heavy in the water. So I can return this to any gold hoarder, gold hoarder or any outpost. I don't particularly have to give it back to the same guy that I picked up the quest from. I'm not sure how I'm climbing the ladder with the chest. Let's go ahead and put it down here. Nice and safe. Just kinda, just kinda sit right there. Excellent, everyone was pretty good. We did a little quest. I mean, we didn't turn it in, but we found the island. We avoided the snakes. We found buried treasure. All in all, I'd say a successful operation. Now I think it's time we hit the open ocean. Let's find a, a way that I want to sail. Let's see. So we're in something called the wilds. In fact, we're smack dab in the middle of the wilds. Let's see if there's a nicer sounding area that we can go to. The shores of plenty. That sounds pretty nice. The ancient isles also sounds pretty cool. The devil's roar sounds like a big no-no. We will not be going there. And then the shores of gold. It's all kind of grayed out. Like we can't go over there or we haven't explored it or something. So we're going to head to the shores of plenty. So we're going to turn around and we're just going to head west head west and maybe we head west we hook a left south and we head down to these ancient isles maybe but we're just gonna sail around we're just gonna enjoy the open ocean and i will be singing some sea shanties with you all so please enjoy the rest of the video as i remember to raise the anchor and if you really like this and you want me to do another Sea of Thieves video and you wanna... Let's actually lower the sails. Let's catch that. And you want me to uh, maybe sing different sea shanties, I can always try to like learn more. And I'm gonna turn that hood off again. So yeah, um, if you have a... Oh look! The cloud, it looks like a galleon. Like a big ship. How cool. Are there any other cool things in the clouds? Look at that. That must be like, that's a good sign for sure, right? That we're gonna have a lucky day at sea. No sea monsters, no enemy ships, hopefully. Yes, if you have a favorite sea shanty and I don't sing it today, you can feel free to leave it. Um, I'll, I'll have a listen if I do another one, and if I like it, I think it's suitable for a video, then maybe I'll learn it. Okay. Um, but no promises if I even do another one of these, because who knows, maybe softly sung sea shanties is not a good ASMR trigger. And... the seas calm down a little bit too because they're kind of wild right now it's not the most chill atmosphere but all right just sit back relax try not to get wet <laughs> it's a real choppy out here and enjoy some sea shanties and for those of you who are gonna fall asleep bid you good night sleep tight don't let Davy Jones longer bite. It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> the
skeletons that we see on the beach, don't let them bite. And I'll see you all in my next video. Alright. There once was a ship that blew to sea. The name of the ship was the Billy of Tea. The winds blew up, her bow dip down. Oh, blow my bully boys, blow. Soon may the weller man come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. She had not been two weeks from shore, when down on her our right will bore. The captain called our hands and swore he'd take that whale in tow. Soon may the weller man come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. Before the boat had hit the water, the whale's tail came up and caught her all hands to the side, harpooned and fought her when she dived down low. Soon may the weller man come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tongue is done, we'll take our leave and go. No line was cut, no whale was freed, the captain's mind was not of greed. And he belonged to the whaleman's creed, she took that ship in tow. Soon may the weller man come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. For forty days, or even more, the line went slack, then tight once more. All boats were lost, there were only four, but still that whale did go. Soon may the weller man come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. As far as I've heard, the fight's still on, the line's not cut, and the whale's not gone. The weller man makes his regular call to encourage the captain, crew, and all. Soon may the weller man come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. Soon may the weller man come to bring us sugar and tea and rum. One day when the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. Way, hey, and up she rises, way, hey, and up she rises, way, hey, and up she rises, way, lie in the morning. What will we do with the drunken sailor? What will we do with the drunken sailor? What will we do with the drunken sailor? Where lie in the morning. Way, hey, up she rises, way, hey, up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises, air light in the morning. Put him in the scuppers with the hose pipe on him. Put him in the scuppers with the hose pipe on him. Put him in the scuppers with the hose pipe on him, air light in the morning. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises, air light in the morning. Put him in the brig until he's sober. Put him in the brig until he's sober. Put him in the brig until he's sober. Early in the morning. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises. Early in the morning. Help me, Bob. I'm bullying in the alleyway. Bully in the alley. Help me, Bob. I'm bullying in the alley. Bully down in Chimbona. Sally is the girl that I love dearly. Way. Bully in the alley. Sally is the girl that I spice dearly. Bully down in Chimbona. Help me, Bob. I'm bully in the alleyway. Bully in the alley. Help me, Bob. I'm bully in the alley. Bully down in Chimbona. 
for seven long years I courted little Sally way Bully in the alley But all she did was dilly and dally Bully down in shimbo now Help me Bob, I'm bully in the alley way Bully in the alley Help me Bob, I'm bully in the alley Bully down in shimbo now I ever get back, I'll marry little Sally way Bully in the alley, have six kids And live in shimbo alley Bully down in shimbo now so help me Bob, I'm bully in the alleyway Bully in the alley, help me Bob I'm bully in the alley, bully down in Shimbo now Help me Bob, I'm bully in the alleyway Bully in the alley, help me Bob I'm bully in the alley Bully down in Jimbo now I dreamed a dream The other night Lowlands Lowlands away Me join My love she came Dressed in white Lowlands away I dreamed my love came in my sleep Lowlands, lowlands away me John Her cheeks were wet, her eyes did weep Lowlands away she came to me at my bedside Lowlands, lowlands away me join All dressed in white like some fair bride Lowlands away and bravely in her bosom fair Lowlands, lowlands away me join Her red, red robes my love did wear Lowlands away She made no sound no word she said Lowlands Lowlands away me joy And then I knew my love was dead Lowlands away Then I awoke Hear the cry Lowlands, lowlands away me joy On watch on deck, watch ahoy Lowlands away I thought I heard the old man say Leave her, Johnny, leave her Tomorrow you will get your pay And it's time for us to leave her Leave her, Johnny, leave her Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her for the voyage is long and the winds don't blow And it's time for us to leave her For oh, the wind was foul and the sea ran high Leave her Johnny, leave her 
She shipped it green and none went by And it's time for us to leave her Leave her Johnny, leave her Leave her Johnny, leave her For the voyage is long and the winds don't blow And it's time for us to leave her I hate to sail on this rotten tub Leave her, Johnny, leave her No grog allowed and rotten grub And it's time for us to leave her Leave her, Johnny, leave her Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her For the voyage is long and the winds don't blow And it's time for us to leave her we swear by road for want of more Leave her, Johnny, leave her But now we're through, so we'll go on shore And it's time for us to leave her Leave her, Johnny, leave her Oh, leave her, Johnny, leave her for the voyage is long and the winds don't blow And it's time